Or taxes? No, never. <laughs> oh, I could have high density it at the same time. Shit, you're right. <clears throat> Especially since people were in favor of all the other changes going on there. Nightclub. There's a popular nightclub in Tresno that is frequented by both men and women. Some counselors are worried there about the threat to morales as young women are drinking alcohol, smoking tobacco, and wearing makeup there. They say that such pastimes are not suitable for women and want something done. What's your view? Decent women don't go to ni nightclubs. Or women can go to nightclubs if they wish to. Well, obviously we're going to say that. Um, hey, more fun. Excellent. And also is more progressive and less of a Luddite, Luddite kind of role. Power plant over here. Do we have any upgrades? Nope, we've got them all. Okay. So basically, all the institutions are the ones with the blue tees. Oh, there's our courthouse. No upgrades unlocked, but I think we're working our way towards it, so we'll have to remember that. Raise taxes. 100%. Women shouldn't wear makeup. That's for men only. There you go. Those are the sorts of uh, laws we're going to pass. It's like uh, um, uh, when you're playing Democracy 3, and you're like, um, you're like, okay, we're going to allow, we're, you know, it's, it's when we're playing our Quill Essentialist religion run with Essentia. Uh, and we were playing a, a, like a, a super theocracy, super religious place. Uh, but it was a different kind of religion. We allowed gay marriage, but we banned all divorce. Anyone can get married, but you can never unmarry. I thought, you know, that was a good way to go. <laughs> uh, we are easily going to pass this. And yeah, I should have paired this with the uh, the density increase. Bum, 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 bum. That's good. And we'll check the other votes. That's easily going to go. And the mayoral vote. Which for some reason is bizarrely hard to click on. Uh, looks like that's easily going to go through as well. So I'm not going to go and browbeat anyone else. It's going to be fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's time for the vote now. Actually, um, begin vote. Do 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 do. Boom! Vote passed. Interesting little lag there. I, oh, I don't know if it was doing an autosave in the background. What I'm going to do, just in case, is I'm going to go ahead and uh, blah, 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 blah. Just make a save here. Yeah, I think that's what it is. I think it was a um, an autosave going on in the background. But I'll make a hard save anyway. Just because we are an hour into this, so what the heck, right? You tank your physical environment by mixing industry and residential. Oh... High heels were once a status symbol for men only, then women started using them. Yeah, I think high heels were invented as a um, as a better way to keep the foot in the stirrup. So it was something that uh, people who rode horses would wear, which of course were men. Women were riding like side style, side saddle or whatever, right? Which is like a super crappy way to ride. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men and women are created equal. Uh, so, community college... Is, oh, it's an upgrade to a university, not a new building. Okay, and we've got some acts here for basic education. Working class and lower class will have more money available. Ah, uh, because they won't have to pay for basic education. We could also do free education altogether. Appeals office, the upgrade to a courthouse. And we can unlock taxation by company type. So, era one looks completely done. Era two... Here's what I'm thinking. Because I had been playing on a pre-release version, um, and then changes happened, I'm actually wondering if some of these things... I mean, obviously we have university. Um, let's take a look, right? So, um, representation, right? Um, I'm trying to think of, like, an edict I can actually just pass, like, directly. Right? As opposed to something that comes up with an event. So, like, surgical hygiene over here. And mandatory vaccination. Actually, I remember seeing mandatory vaccination. Didn't we? First, let's see. Is it one we already passed? Um, no. Is it in the list of available? It is in there. And as an anesthetic pain relief. So we must have unlocked it. I'm either it's I don't know if it's a glitch in the base game or again. There's gonna be a lot of weird stuff because I was playing a, a like a two month early preview copy. So things can be really weird in that situation. So I'm gonna have to assume that this mostly went. Um, and it's weird. Some of these aren't even connected. 
Oh, it's because I haven't unlocked hydraulics. But I have a high school, obviously. So yeah, some things, it broke what it thinks is unlocked, but I think it still remembers that I've unlocked the things, even though it shows me the text having been incomplete at this point. Okay, um, let's go and get some, some hardware stuff unlocked here. Um, what's our, what's some of our lowest environment? Health. Health is a little lower. Let's get antibiotics going on. That sounds like a good idea. Equality. <clears throat> it's over a century since the French Revolution gave birth to human rights and the ideals of liberty, brotherhood, and equality. Now these ideals are spreading like wildfire, wildfire, and there's a call to expand them to cover a wide portion of society. What do you think we should start? Equal opportunity. This would pass the Basic Education Act, which sounds fantastic and is very sort of simpatico with our, our entire family plan of, like, um, tech and science and education. Equality between genders, which is the Livelihood Act. As men earn their families' livelihoods, widows are often driven to begging the streets for a living. There's not a problem for younger women who can remarry, but a special livelihood fund could alleviate the situation for women too old to marry. Or liberty to produce, pursue goals... I don't know what it does. It doesn't seem to pass a law directly, or maybe it's one we've already got, or it's going to give some other bonus instead. I think I would like to pass one of these edicts. I, these are both super important, and I can't decide which one. I think... I think I'm going to go Basic Education Act. Which is going to give a penalty to personal growth, which makes no sense, but give people more money. Choose the one that would be hardest to pass. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Actually, it's it looks... You know what? It looks like equality between genders would be easiest because while they're both super left-wing, right? If you look at the green blob, they're both super left-wing, but the bottom one um, is considered to be more pro-conservative as opposed to pro-liberal. Um, as such, all the parties that lean more conservative, it actually should be easier to pass the Livelihood Act normally. So equality of opportunity seems to be the harder one to pass, and um, education is good. Let's go ahead and do that. I like the logic. Also equality, yeah, so that gave us the boost to that decision, which is going to go right away. We're going to begin voting, and that's going to pass that. Okay. I like how 1927 Quilopolis is more progressive than some 2017 countries. Well, yeah, I mean, what the heck, right? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pinko liberal communist something. So it makes sense. Totally makes sense. This is the thing with like the achievements and stuff, right? And then this one here, they both say logbook, which is a tooltip error, um, shows me the progress towards various victories. We're furthest along the economic and political victory, not science victory. So clearly I'm not doing a very good job. I don't have first graduates. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Like, do we need more? How do we get more people there? Probably bringing more kids out of, like, forcing them to work and whatever. And also making education free is probably going to go a long way. Um, so university should now... We've unlocked the ability to have the, um, the community college. So this is going to go ahead and boost personal growth, boost fun, and boost brain power. And cost fifteen hundred. Everyone's super in favor of it, so let's quicken the vote. At the same time, courthouse, we're going to upgrade you to. I don't remember what the second level of upgrade was called, but it's going to give a big bonus bonus to security emanating from the courthouse. Uh, it's going to cost five million dollars. So we have tons in the bank, so we're going to go with that. Everyone thinks it's a great idea. We're going to go ahead and quicken the vote as well. Um, let's just take a quick look at the unemployment rights. It's going to raise the labor rights from three to four. Everyone's super happy still. That's great. Prior to penicillin and medical research, death was an everyday occurrence. It was intimate. Mm -hmm. Upgrade density of all districts. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. Also, if there's anything else we can unlock and give them would be good. We could wait. I don't know if there's something else that um, is going to unlock that we could put in at the same time. Public Defender's Office is another upgrade for the courthouse. Waste bins. This, to me, I think the gears is something else that you can like place in your city. So if we did public health, we could place waste bins at the same time as we increase density. 
Uh, we could add playgrounds. Sports grounds. Ooh, bikinis. Um, we the metro, but I still haven't done... I mean, maybe I need um, public transport at some point. I'm not sure. Metered parking. There's a lot of little options here. I'll start with public health. Do we want to raise the density now? I mean, more city population is always fun. We want a city to grow. Um, and it has actually grown since the start of the stream. We're at 9,000 people at the start of the stream. It's already up to 13,000. Um, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a new district as is. Even without all the different things unlocked. Too large. So I guess we should pull you back maybe to around here. Um, and actually... There we go. Right over there. And like that. So this is going to be our plan. I'm going to make this, so obviously high density. Um, and I will go with the considerably more... So very little industry over here. I realize it's still going to be mixed. Actually, like literally this is all going to be mixed area. Which is fine, I think. There's kind of demand for everything. What do you think of this? 44 to 20, as people are saying in the chat, is a good number. I don't know. Sounds good. Uh, obviously, we're going to want water. Electricity. Um, telephone lines. We're trying to phase out gas infrastructure. It's actually something we're going to be able to ban outright later on. Um, we're going to want sewage, electric streetlights. Um, police call box. You know what? This is our first high density. Let's go ahead and add in a tram line and a bus network. All the things. Phone booths, traffic lights. Yeah, sounds great. Um, it's, yeah, currently it's going to be fine. The cost will go up. Maybe we'll make the roads real good too. Asphalt roads. How crazy is that? So it's still only going to use a fraction of our, our current reserve. Running costs are going up. And in fact, they'll go up when I add services as well. So, um, we're going to want, I want more, edu oh, we don't have a mental health clinic yet. Oh, look at this, it's going to tank, um, um, security in the area, but that's okay. We're going to go and build our first mental health clinic there. We're going to build a full park just across the street there. So kids can play next to the crazy people. Wow. I shouldn't say crazy. Um, we want, we want more education. So high school. Grammar school. There's actually no schooling over here at all. Uh, do we also throw in a vocational school? Sure. Actually, we'll do this. Oh, it does fit. So it'll also... Oh, I think I accidentally canceled my grammar school. There it goes. Um, let's see, we can plan a theater for some more fun, and a church for a little bit more social life. And maybe a police station. Up over that way. There we go. So some people are like starting to think, oh, this is too expensive, they're not super entirely in favor, but mostly it's going to be there. This should be a relatively easy um, place to do. Oh, the park was deleted. Okay, well, oh, oh, from this here. Yes, thank you. Because I did delete the grammar school, but apparently I also deleted the park. There we are. Okay. Fire station? I actually don't even know if we have a fire station in the entire city. Oh, we do, actually. We have one here, so it's already overlapping. If we're going to do anything with the fire station, it's going to involve building one down here, which has no fire protection. So, yeah, I'm not going to place a fire station. Is 
Did I build a normal health clinic? I did not, actually. And, oh, there's... We only have one way down here. No wonder our health is a little bit lower. Um, so let's go and get one there. All right, confirm. I'm going to... When you name it, I think it'll pop it up. So this is going to cost us $11 million to build and cost us 700 k a month to maintain. But, of course, new people will move in here. So it's gonna, currently going to cost us our entire budget, but our taxation will go up as people move into this district, hopefully. And we still have lots of money in the bank. It's only going to use half the money in the bank overall. Propose that. There it is. And looking for a subscriber name in the chat. No. Strider! Strider! Striderville! Um, people are way in favor of it, so we're going to use a quick and vote. Except for the, the Nazis. There we are. Public library. I thought I put one down. I'm not sure. All right. We are ready to vote on upgrading institutions. So we're going to begin vote one. Right. This is also going to use our monthly budget a little, I think, for upgrading the institution. That's okay. So that was overwhelmingly passed. Then we're going to upgrade the university as well. Overwhelmingly passed. Excellent. And in a moment, unemployment funds will finally pass. So yeah. Goodbye, economy. It's fine. Unemployment funding is going to easily pass. Goodwill is still averaging zero, but that's okay. All right, unemployment fund in place. Workers to receive dole. While many fear the dole will reward laziness, while supporters suggest it is in the society's best interest to provide the unemployed with some sort of insurance and income, no matter how meager. And let's just verify here. Yeah, that's still good. So let's take our see what our income does at the end of this month since we did just implement a bunch of new stuff. Now we're fine. New district. So that's going to also easily pass. Victory step completed. Think tank. Okay. Blam. Oh, decriminalize same-sex relationships. It is hereby proposed that laws against homosexuality be repo repealed. So I'm going to support the repeal. No punishment for a homosexual relationship. Excellent. And actually, a lot of uh, the parties had actually been sort of, they considered that to be an important edict for them. And if we do this, it should help the support. We're going to support that. Yes, well going to be supported. We are going to decriminalize homosexual relationships. I remember, like, it was a big deal when we made the punishment not super severe. It's like, <laughs> that was progress. We're not going to punish them too harshly. Mm, since you're using a lot of, an old save, a lot of things are broken for you. Yeah. Uh, if you start a new game, expect a lot of things to change. And I expect that to be absolutely the case as well. So we have a new district over here. Right now, we're, we're losing money. But that's because we're having to wait for people to move into the new district. We, we put down all the services. If you build it, they will come, right? Antibiotics. Um, Alexander Fleming's invention of penicillin has brought hope to many who would have earlier have been doomed. With continuing work on different types of antibiotics, it's clear that the population's health is about to rise to ever-increasing heights. The city administration is trying to figure out the consequences of longer, healthier life will be. Antibiotics will allow more complex surgeries. Antibiotics will allow better homes treatments. Well, both those are true. Although, antibiotics will allow people to go home, only take half their antibiotics, feel better, stop taking their antibiotics, get sick again, and now we have antibiotic-resistant bacteria. It's not the only way it came about, but I'm going to say it's going to allow more complex surgeries. So, this is going to change the upgrade cost for Central Hospital by 25%, which is nice. We actually may have some upgrades for that soon. Public health. Improvements in public health over the last hundred years have been dramatic. Many diseases that were once lethal are now easily cured. At the same time, understanding that preventative action is the best way to increase general health. Which of the following do you think the public sector can help most with? Quality public baths, a cleaner environment, better health education methods. Education. This is going to give a bonus to health from grammar schools. Grammar schools, which, which I think we have eight, are going to give plus one health now. That's quite nice. Mm -hmm. Population should cross to 14,000. The buildings are being built. There we go, 14,000. So the tax base keeps going up and up and up and up. So Striderville is going to fill up. I have full faith in that, and our money situation will improve with every tick of the month. Bam. Look at this. Now we're making money. And now we're making less money. Okay. Never do anything you wouldn't want to explain to the paramedics. That's actually quite funny. So we've unlocked the swimming hall. We can endorse physical and education, put in waste bins, vagamon services. Mm-hmm. 
So I wanted to see how this save kept going, but it is a good point that um, most likely if we had... Look at this. It, uh, personal growth looks the same, but our research timers are going down. Uh, I suspect that... Um, oh, but this might not be an absolute value. That's probably it. Um, I suspect that if we did start a new game, there would be a lot of things that would be quite different with the progress cloud, and it's possible that some of our laws actually just won't work because we moved from something that... Um, clearly, something in the data files changed along the way. I'm still wondering actually, if we should go and unlock some of these things to push some decisions that may not be triggering correctly. I'm going to try one of these. Watch it crash the game. Personal growth and brain power are different things. Right. Thank you very much for the reminder. Yes, that's right. And brain power is not listed here. It's listed somewhere else. So we got a lot more brain power, so we're teching a lot faster. I tell you what, I'm going to finish the third era text. And if we haven't gone to the fourth yet, I mean, you can start early. I'll go back and finish the second level or finish it again, which we clearly have done once. Um, television. It's the opiate of the masses. Well, religion was the opiate of the masses, but... So is there anything else I can do here? Looks like no, not right now. Just the Twin Cities, but I'm betting later on we unlock more international thingamabobs to click. Uh, uh, Ram power is light bulb on the middle top bar. Oh, up here! Thank you. Yeah. Plus 90 from the university. Okay. Those feel like we're teching super duper fast. So population keeps going up. Money keeps, well, mostly going up. It'll fluctuate a little month to month, but overall huge upward trend especially as this town continues to fill out. And yeah, we will go in higher density, all the others. I'm not going to rush it, again, as we keep unlocking all kinds of things. Um, this actually won't unlock a new district uh, decision, so that was a bit of an oops, but it does have the TV tower. I would like it if there's a, a quick and easy way to, for me to tell, like, have I gotten... There we go. Have I gotten all the, um, the institution upgrades? I think we just got one for the courthouse as well. That's vocational schools. Um, I meant to click here, courthouse. I think we just, oh, public defender's office is going to come soon. Yeah, there's probably something. Okay. Um, first, okay, the vote on upgrading institutions is coming soon, but we've got a decision to make about marriage. You are about to get married! George? Jorg? There's no E at the end. I don't know if that's, like, legit for like a German thing, or I don't know. George is a German engineer who specializes in code breaking systems and computing devices. Computers? Cool. He left Germany because he felt his scientific freedom was compromised. Together, you have long discussions on technology and medicine. What have you learned from him? An interdisciplinary approach or skepticism? Interdisciplinary approach. That's our name for doing it. Like, we're, we have an interdisciplinary approach. Wink. So this is going to give a bonus to personal growth from universities. Excellent. That sounds swell. And television! Television is the hottest new thing. Your city administration is making plans on how best to adapt for a new era of television. What should they focus on? Tool to control the population. It's like very 1984. Just, you know, a few decades early. Tool for informing the population or tool for connecting people. We are going to use it to inform the population. Because that's our theme. So we're getting a bonus to personal growth from to the elite and the middle class. All right, let's vote on upgrading the institutions over here. We're going to begin that. So it's going to increase the uh, central hospital with the hospital surgical ward. There we are. Easy passing. It does cost $2.1 million to do, but seems well worthwhile, giving us a bigger health bonus throughout. Quillis Television, but no electricity. We do have electricity. First of all, we have even an electrical power plant over here that has been upgraded once. We have electricity. Most of our districts have access to electricity as well. <gasps> the circus is coming! We're going to let restaurants open food stalls in the streets. We're going to have a party. Um, so sales demand, restaurant, plus 80%. I wonder if they changed some of the, 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 the way the sales demand worked. Maybe they, they, it was counterintuitive because it seems to have inverted from the way it was in my preview build. Television is the menace that everyone loves to hate but can't seem to live without. Black and white TV, television... TV tower, banned pornography, museum, they have pornography on TV.